On the, the October 15th performance will be a good one for somebody who, who's not familiar with opera. This one's going to be um, kind of an opera gala format, so it's going to be selections from operas, um, some of the most popular operas. Uh, these are all, and these are all popular operas for a reason. You know, it's it's the best of the literature, and we'll be doing the best parts of the best operas of the literature. It should be like a really good introductory performance. Uh, the talent level is very high, and it's like the best scenes, like the highlights, the hits, you know, opera hits, and it's very accessible. We're working on a, a Spanish operetta, which is called Tartuela. I mean, even though many of our students here speak Spanish, none of them know Castilian Spanish, because these are all operas from Spain, not from South America or Cuba or something like that. She's thinking about finding her male. Finding her Palomo, her, her male counterpart, but she's starting to show that she's got feelings, longings, and you know. Justin Moss, who is uh, our director of our Broward operations will be narrating the scenes so he will come out and introduce the singers in the scene and tell us the background about the characters and the plot so the audience will have a, an idea what's going on even though they don't have it in their program. I just, the music is just so it's like the the perfect combination of you know stunning stunning music and you know intense dramatics and you know, it just, when done right, you know, when everything comes together, it just, even if you're performing, it just makes you, makes you want to cry. Even people who aren't familiar with opera will probably recognize some of the music we're going to do on the 15th. Um, if just from, you know, TV commercials or things like that, you know, little cliche opera excerpts. Caballero de la plumero, donde camino? 